Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do your daily vibes for Monday, February 5th, 2018. This is for all signs. We are going to start with one of these angel romance cards. And go from there. I don't typically use this deck in my daily vibes, but I was called to do it today. Ooh, there's a reason. Romantic feelings. Your feelings are real and worth exploring. Imagine that. It's true. It's true. Your feelings are real. So whatever you're feeling, go with it. Don't. This is saying trust your inner guide, trust your thoughts, trust your feelings, okay? Many of you have a love interest that you're, you're wondering about, and this is the yes. Yes, okay? The answer is yes. Go for it. Perfect card, if you ask me. Ooh, throat chakra. This right here is regards to I speak. I speak. I speak my truth. So like I said, a minute, it even falls in line with this one. Romantic feelings. If you feel like you feel for somebody and you're afraid to talk to them, this card is saying, do it. Do it. Speak up. I speak my truth regarding how I feel. And when you do, you have so much to gain. Okay? I feel like many of you have come to a point of abundance, feeling abundant within yourself. This says material harvest. It's more than just material harvest. This is the ultimate abundance right here. This is when you feel good about who you are, you've worked on yourself, you feel good about what you've accomplished in life, and you're, and you're just kind of like at your peak, okay? So I feel like many of you, I mean, this is also a card of... of prosperity okay and it's usually independent prosperity that you have obtained on your own and when you when you get to this spot of being grateful for all that you are all that you have all that you do you know the storm is over so I feel like for many of you it's it's a time of harvest period okay that you've earned it <laughs> disruption this is the tower card so when this card comes up I feel like there's been a major shift there's been a major shift there's been a major change in your life and this card is not always bad this is a blessing in disguise I feel like something has happened in your life that has caused you to go through a period of perhaps introspection even though this is not the hermit card this is the nine of pentacles this is a person who goes through whatever they need to do to get where they need to be, all right? So I think that, that this time of nurturing yourself, of taking care of yourself, of building your own foundation, of doing whatever you need to do to, do to excel, was, it may have, this, this period may have come out of chaos. Some kind of disruption may have forced you to go into this period of reflection, of renewal, perhaps, um, and now you, that you've gotten to this spot of and really enjoying who you are inside and out, now is the time for you to get your harvest, receive your reward for all the work that you have done, okay? I feel this tower card in this reading is definitely not a bad thing. I think it's a good thing. I think that blessings are coming in out of chaos, okay? And I do feel like there could be, for some of you that are watching this, there's a love interest that you are being call, called to tell them your feelings, okay? Tell them how you feel. Seriously, tell how you feel. Your feelings are real and worth exploring, okay? And you have a lot to offer. So if you're feeling down, like in the past, like you didn't have enough to offer, you do have a lot to offer. Somebody that's watching this is the whole package. And the person that you are 
having romantic feelings for, they're probably the whole package too. Okay, it's like a, the whole that's it's the real deal. Okay, but and, and the thing is, is now you're ready. I think there was some kind of disruption, some kind of upheaval in your life that made you get ready for this. Okay, and now it's really time to speak up about how you feel. Light. We had this card the other day. It's a beautiful card. Imagine yourself as a being composed of energy and light. Because in reality, that's precisely what you are. You are a powerful being and people are attracted to your brilliance. This is a time to remember how vibrant you truly are. You are truly a vibrant being and this is truly showing it. It shows that you have gotten to a point where you are vibrating on a higher level. And with that high vibration, it really makes you the pick of the litter. I mean, it makes you very um, desirable. So if you're feeling, at, or if you were feeling like you were unworthy, I'm, tell, I'm here to tell you that you're not, okay? Somebody could be having real romantic feelings for you, or you're having romantic feelings for them, and you're being called to talk about it, to, to express it. Seriously, express your feelings to somebody, okay? That's what I see. We're going to get one of these whispers of love. Why I chose love this on this day is I think there's a good reason for that. I think that love is in the air, and I'm pretty happy about it. Ooh, consider your foundation. You are being asked to look at how committed you are to love. How committed are you? That's the question here, okay? One of them. I want to make sure this was zoomed in. How committed are you to love? Are you committed to talking? Are you committed to communication? Because this is communication, all right? Are you committed? Because if you're really looking for love, you have to communicate your feelings to make the relationship grow. You've come to a point in your life where you're vibrating very highly, okay? You're feeling very good about yourself. You have done the inner work that you need to do. You've realized that everything is energy and out of chaos brings reward. So that's what I see. I feel like I feel like there's been some kind of dis disruption in your life that has caused you to do some inner work. Now there's new feelings for somebody or feelings that you've had for a while that aren't even new and you haven't been able to express. And the universe is saying, please express them. Express them. If you're really committed to love, tell somebody. Tell the person you're thinking about. That's what I have. Talk to you later.